what's the one car that you always see in most wanted lobbies? This car is probably your answer. Now you might be wondering if you never played this game before, why is this car the fan favorite? Well, I'll tell ya after this announcement. Go, baby, go, baby, go, baby. Gotta keep moving on. Before I start this video, I just want to say again, thank you for coming back to WSP. It really means a lot to us. Um, we we kind of had a little bit of a rocky start, and you know, it's just I just thank you guys for coming right back to the channel, even when you know most of our videos is gone. The history of ours is just kind of like gone now. So you know, it's not easy on us, especially on me, but. You know, I'm still going to be here trying to create content. I'm going to try a different type of content today. But, you know, thank you for still watching the videos. They do mean a lot to to us. Uh, please keep watching them. I promise I will try to always deliver on the content, <laughs> even when you know, nobody else is. Um, but, yeah, again, thank you so much. Uh, I really want you to enjoy this video. And, yeah, thank you. That's all I have to say. Enjoy. Okay, so back to the Porsche. What makes the Porsche such a great car? Well, it's the top speed that makes him so viable in so many situations. Compared to other cars like the Diablo, this car accelerates so much out of its own top speed. That is why it's the go-to for most players. While the handling is kind of iffy, this car has little to no flaws. If you know how to use it, that is. Yes, Porsche engineers, you can rest easy knowing you accomplish your objective. Let's compare this car to other cars like the Reventon. Viper. Heck, even the Diablo. times out of 10 the Porsche is most likely going to win it is incredibly broken which why you see in almost every pro lobby with the majority of teams using it but that begs a very specific question what is the Porsche absolute top speed we know it goes over the top speed it's supposed to but we don't know the absolute cap for it we will also test the Diablo just to pan out the video just a little bit oh, baby. Oh, baby. Kiss your... So it is dropping from 390, so it's not that overpowered. It looks to be a 380, nope, 383, 382. Okay, so it's not as, okay, so it's not so overpowered to, oh, whoops. But it does, okay, so on straights, it is kind of powerful. Three, I bet we could hit 380 right here. We can't, okay, so. You could try to go back. Wise, it's yeah, base. It's basically just gaming right there. 370, 370. Yeah, I want to say on this road specifically is 380 at the most. 378, 379, 380. Okay, but probably when it dips from here. It's gonna go up, yep. 382, 383. Okay. Alright. So on straights, it basically withstands until 380, basically. 
now let's go on a drop please so of course it is going to go down but i'm just curious how fast will it go from right here okay we did hit 391 we did hit 391 okay interesting so hold on so If we go over here, all right. So from right here, it is going to go down like it usually is right here. But if we go down right here, and if we take I down, okay. And I'm going to try my best not to mess up anything. So it is hitting 380. I'm going natural right here right here it will 380 okay I'm convinced that the top speed is around 380 382 cuz straight I believe it was 381 with drops is 392 but you decrease a lot from that but this car in here but I'm even going to test it right here it's going to gradually going to gradually gain speed because the Diablo don't do this at all so just remember that the Diablo don't do this so right so look so right here just pure straight 375 right here doesn't really count because it's going upward but you're not gonna see what I'm talking about right here 370 370 just from this straight right here boom it's just straight just straight 377 378 see what this car's over it keeps gaining speed i don't know what the top view of it i have to check out of this but it but it does not say 380 380 right here but I feel like it could go a little bit faster though. So on straights, three three eighty is about as high as you could go in terms of straights. But in terms of maybe just drops, that's three ninety two. Three ninety two. But obviously that's going to drop because you're drifting, or whatever. But in straights, it's three eighty. Glad we got that. Go baby, go baby, go baby Gotta keep moving